okay once again good morning all of you so in last lecture we have started the next point that is radiation shields so what is meant by radiation shield that is in certain situation it is required to reduce the overall heat transfer between the two radiating surfaces javel aplyala heat transfer kami karaycha for that case we have to use the radiation shield or this is done by the either using materials which is highly reflective or by using the radiation shield so radiation shield is nothing but it is a highly reflective material by using that we have to reduce the overall heat transfer between the two radiating surfaces overall heat transfer between the two radiating surfaces okay so the radiation shield reduces the radiation heat transfer by effectively increasing the surface resistances okay so there are two types of resistances first one is surface resistance there and second one is space resistance so if we are putting the one plate in between the two radiating surfaces because of that plate what will happen surface resistance will be increases and we know that what is the standard equation for the rate of heat transfer that is q is equal to temperature difference divided by summation of resistances so if denominator is increases then automatically heat transfer rate will be decreases heat transfer rate will be decreases okay so the radiation shield reduce the radiation heat transfer by effectively increasing the surface resistances without actually removing any heat from the overall system actually in the overall heat, overall system the heat transfer rate is same what will happen because of that plate the heat transfer or whatever the heat inside that overall system that should be same only difference because of that plate surface resistance will be increases and if surface resistance is increases then automatically overall heat transfer rate will be decreases okay then what are the different materials for the radiation shield that is thin sheet of plastic coated with highly reflective metallic film on both side okay thin sheet of plastic coated with the highly reflective metallic films on both side serves as a very effective radiation shield samajh le ka ek plastic plate asnar hai ani tyachya varti kay asnar hai reflecting metallic film doni side la paste kelele asnar hai ani that material is nothing but it is a very effective radiation shield it is a very effective radiation shield what are the applications of this radiation shield that is applications of radiation shield in the measurement of the temperature of a fluid by thermometer okay je kai thermometer na apan temperature measure karto fluid cha kya je thermometer varti je kai coating hai kiwa je kai shield hai that is nothing but radiation shield which is shielded to reduce the effect of radiation because of that radiation shield what will happen that reduce the effects of the radiation jo kai radiation cha effect honar hai because of that plate what will happen the radiation effect should be reduces okay so our aim is to calculate the heat transfer rate when there is a radiation shield in between the two radiating surfaces surfaces mhanje don radiating surfaces aple kade te radiation it exchange hola gela tya don plate madhe in between that two plates we have to putting one radiation shield त्या दोन्ही प्लेटच्या मध्ये आपण काय करणार आहे रेडिएशन शिल्ड पुट करणार आहे ऑलरेडी वी हॅव डिराइव इक्वेशन फॉर दी इफ टू प्लेट्स आर देयर अँड इन बिटवीन दिस टू प्लेट देयर इज अ नो रेडिएशन शिल्ड इज देयर ओके मींस क्यू विदाउट शिल्ड सो फॉर दैट वी हॅव डिराइव दी इक्वेशन अँड व्हाट इज दैट इक्वेशन क्यू 1 टू 2 इज इक्वल टू सिग्मा टी 1 रेस टू 4 माइनस टी 2 रेस टू 4 डिवाइडेड बाय समेशन ऑफ रेजिस्टेंसेस सो फ्रॉम दैट वी गेट दी ग्रेव वॉल फैक्टर एज ए 1 अपॉन 1 upon epsilon 1 plus 1 upon epsilon 2 minus 1 so this is the for the radiating bodies are infinite parallel planes okay so at that time we have not consider the radiation shield but in the last derivation that is radiation shield derivation we have considering the two plates and in between two plates we have considering one radiation shield okay so for that we have considering two parallel plates one and two of area same area is there at temperature t1 and t2 respectively with a radiation shield placed between them okay so we know that what is the equation if there is a no plate is there in between that two plates there is a no any plate is there so what is the equation for that that is q122 net is equal to a sigma t1 raised to 4 minus t2 raised to 4 divided by 1 upon epsilon 1 plus 1 upon epsilon 2 minus 1 and that is the equation number 1 so in if there is a radiation shield is there so heat transfer is takes place from the plate 1 to surface 3 and from the plate surface 3 to 
plate number two. So we have to write down the equation for that. That is Q13 and Q32. So what is the equation for the Q13? Similarly, we have to write down the equation for Q13. That is A sigma T1 raised to four minus T3 raised to four minus, sorry, divided by one upon epsilon one plus one upon epsilon three minus one. Okay. Yes, sir, present the screen. Okay, earlier sir. Earlier, earlier. Okay, earlier, earlier. Okay, so in this way we have written the equation for plate one to two. We have uh, already derived that equation. So in that. In that form, we have written the equation Q1 to 2. That is the equation number 1. Then if we are putting the radiation shield in between the two plates, then heat transfer takes place from one first plate to third plate. So we have written the equation in the manner of equation 1. That is the equation number 2. Similarly, we have re written the equation for the heat transfer from the plate number 3 to plate number 2. So in that manner, we have to return the equation for the Q322. Okay. So these are the equation 1, 2, 3 is there. Equation one is if there is a no radiation shield. Equation two is from plate one to three, and equation three is from plate three to two. So in that way, we have written the equation. But whatever the heat, this is system. Upon consider ke liye, zari upon radiation shield put ke liye. Then the overall system only heat kar rana hai, same rana hai. So therefore, we have to putting the Q13 net is equal to Q32 net. Okay. So we have equating that two equation. So whatever the denominator of the first equation, that is one upon epsilon one plus one upon epsilon three minus one. And then instead of that, we are putting the value as a X and one upon epsilon three plus one upon epsilon two minus one. Instead of that, we have put it the value Y. Next slide. Yes, sir. Okay. So by putting that values, we get the equation as a T1 raised to four because A sigma, A sigma at the both sides that will be canceled. So remaining equation as a T1 raised to 4 minus T3 raised to 4 divided by X is equal to T3 raised to 4 minus T2 raised to 4 divided by Y. Okay. We have simplified this equation. Then we get the equation as a T1 raised to 4 divided by X plus T2 raised to 4 divided by Y is equal to T3 raised to 4 Y divided by Y plus T3 raised to 4 divided by X. So from the right hand side, we have take the common as a T3 raised to 4. So what is the remaining equation in the bracket? That is X plus Y divided by XY. We have taken the LCM. Similarly, in the left hand side, we have taken the LCM. So because of that, what is the LCM of the left hand side? That is XY. So what is the numerator? We have to take the cross multiplication. So therefore, Y T1 raised to 4 plus X T2 raised to 4. Okay. So XY x, y at the left hand side and right hand side will be cancelled. So what is the remaining equation? y, t1 raised to 4 plus x, t2 raised to 4 is equal to t3 raised to 4 into bracket x plus y. Okay. So what is the, we get the value of t3 raised to 4. And what is the value of t3 raised to 4? Next slide, yes, sir. What is the value of t3 raised to 4? That is y, t1 raised to 4 plus x, t2 raised to 4 divided by x plus y. Okay, so now we have to put this value into equation number three. What is the equation? Sorry, equation number two that is Q13 net. So in that equation, we have to put the value of T3 raised to four. So what is that equation? So instead of one upon sigma one plus one upon sigma three minus one, we have put it the value as the X. So Q13 is equal to A sigma divided by X into bracket T1 raised to four minus Y T1 raised to four plus X T2 raised to four divided by x y okay so whatever the term in the bracket we have taking the lcm for that bracket so what is the equation in the bracket so a sigma divided by x into bracket what is the denominator of the what is the lcm of these two term that is x plus y then we have to take the cross product then we get the we get the equation as a x t1 raised to 4 plus y t1 raised to 4 minus y t1 raised to 4 minus x t2 raised to 4 okay so y t1 raised to 4 plus yt1 raised to 4 minus yt1 raised to 4 will cancel. So what is the remaining equation? That is q13 is equal to a sigma t1 raised to 4 minus t2 raised to 4 divided by x plus y, x plus y. So already we have put the values of the x and y. 
so we know that what is the values of x y now i have to put the values of x and y so equation becomes q13 is equal to a sigma t1 raised to 4 minus t2 raised to 4 divided by 1 upon epsilon 1 plus 1 upon epsilon 3 minus 1 this is the value of x and what is the value of y that is 1 upon epsilon 3 plus 1 upon epsilon 2 minus 1 okay so by simplification of this equation there are 1 upon sigma 3 two terms are there so in the one uh, first bracket we have to write down the equation as a 1 upon epsilon 1 plus 1 upon epsilon 2 minus 1 and what is the remaining term in the second bracket that is 2 upon sigma 3 minus 1 okay so whatever the heat transfer is takes place from plate 1 to 3 that same amount of heat transfer will be takes place from plate 3 to 2 and that same amount of heat transfer is takes place from plate 1 to 2 okay so in the q13 is equal to q322 and q122 with the shield so this is the equation for the heat transfer rate when there is a radiation shield between the two plates is there javela don plate madhe heat exchange honar hai ani tya don plate cha madhe apan javela radiation shield put karnar hai at that time we have to use this equation so what is the equation when there is a no radiation shield is there. Javala radiation shield is not there. That is the equation. Kai uta, taru a sigma t1 raised to 4 minus t2 raised to 4 divided by 1 upon epsilon 1 plus 1 upon epsilon 2 minus 1. Here extra term kut le le le. Here one another term is arises at the denominator. That term is nothing but 2 upon epsilon 3 minus 1. Manje resistance jo increase alai. Denominator increase alai. Manje kai dalai. Resistance jo increase alai. To kashan increase alai. Resistance increases by 2 upon sigma 3 minus 1. And if the resistance increase alai, then automatically rate of heat transfer will be reduces. So therefore, we have written the, therefore, Q13 value will be reduces. Okay. Samar lega sagana. Rate of heat transfer without shield seek equation hai, and rate of heat transfer with shield seek equation. Hai. Kya doni equation madhe kai for a kali life fuck the high equation madhe q with shield. The equation madhe ek resistance factor just ala and what is that factor 2 upon sigma 3 minus 1. And because of this value or because of this resistance is increases and heat transfer rate will be decreases. Okay, then next slide write down let let. Assume, what we are going to do is whatever the emissivity of each plate, which is plate number 1 as well, plate number 2 as well, plate number 3 as well, what we are going to do is the emissivity of each plate, same consider. So, write down, let assume, let assume, write down that equation. Okay, so write down that equation. Let assume epsilon 1 is equal to epsilon 2 is equal to epsilon 3 is equal to epsilon. What is the meaning of this? Emissivity of each plate is same. Pratik plate is jika emissivity as nara tika as nara same as nara. And for that, now we have to write down the equation. Javala tini pechi emissivity same as nara. For that case, we have to write down the equations. Okay, so write down. Q13 is equal to Q32 is equal to Q122 with shield. So, okay, heat transfer as nara. plate 1 to 3 as well, kiwa plate 3 to 2 as well, kiwa 1 to 2 with shield as well. Then, how is the same as nara. Already, up until the equation. So, write down that equation Q13 heat transfer from plate 1 to 3, then heat transfer from plate 3 to 2, and heat transfer from the plate 1 to 2. That is nothing but with shield. Maja shield javel as nara plate 1 to 2. So what is that equation? Now, whatever the equation we have written in the square box, in that equation we have to put the sigma 1, sorry, epsilon 1 is equal to epsilon 2 is equal to epsilon 3 is equal to epsilon. So by putting that values into the, in that square bo box equation, 1 upon epsilon 1 plus 1 upon epsilon. That is nothing but 2 upon epsilon minus 1 and 2 upon epsilon minus 1 okay we get the equation as a write down that equation a sigma t1 raised to 4 a sigma into bracket t1 raised to 4 minus t2 raised to 4 bracket complete t1 raised to 4 minus t2 raised to 4 bracket complete divided by divided by 
अपन का कन्सिडर करना है एप्सलॉन वन एप्सलॉन टू एप्सलॉन थ्री इज इक्वल टू एप्सलॉन सो इन्स्टेड ऑफ एप्सलॉन वन एप्सलॉन टू एप्सलॉन थ्री वी हेव टू पुट द वैल्यू एज ए एप्सलॉन सो फ्रॉम दैट वी हेव पुटिंग दैट वैल्यूज इन टू दैट स्क्वेर बॉक्स इक्वेशन सो वी गेट द इक्वेशन एज ए टू अपॉन एप्सलॉन माइनस वन इन वन ब्रैकेट प्लस टू अपॉन एप्सलॉन माइनस वन इन दनादर ब्रैकेट ओके मे संगा सो फॉर दिस ज्यादा अपन दोन सर्किट या मध्य एक रेडिएशन शील्ड एक प्लेट प्लेस करना है अपने इक्वेशन का वी गेट द इक्वेशन एज ए टू अपॉन एप्सलॉन माइनस वन प्लस टू अपॉन एप्सलॉन वन एट दी डिनामिनेटर ज्यादा अपन दोन रेडिएटिंग सर्किट या मध्य एक प्लेट अटैच करना है एक प्लेट प्लेस करना है मीनिंग ऑफ दिस इफ सपोज देर आर एन नंबर ऑफ प्लेट्स इन बिटवीन दी टू रेडिएटिंग सर्पे ओके एन नंबर ऑफ रेडिएशन शील्ड्स आर इन बिटवीन दी प्लेट्स देन व्हाट इज द इक्वेशन कैन एनी वन टेल मी का संगा ज्यादा दोन प्लेट मध्य एक रेडिएशन शील्ड है एट दैट टाइम वी गेट द इक्वेशन एज ए टू अपॉन एप्सलॉन माइनस वन प्लस टू अपॉन एप्सलॉन माइनस वन का हो रहा है टू इंटू का हो रहा है इक्वेशन संगा टू इंटू ब्रैकेट टू एप्सलो टू डिवाइडेड बाय एप्सलॉन माइनस वन so similarly we have to tell me the equation for the n number of shields are there can anyone tell me anyone apan javela ek shield put kele at that time we get the denominator as a 2 upon epsilon minus 1 plus 2 upon epsilon minus 1 manje he kay 2 into 2 upon epsilon 1 2 upon epsilon minus 1 hai javela if we are putting the n number of shields then what is the equation can anyone tell me काल संगा इक्वेशन इफ देर आर एन नंबर ऑफ शील्ड्स आर देर देन व्हाट इज द चेंज इन द इक्वेशन एनी वन को एक रेडिएशन शील्डा डिनामिनेटर लाइल तुम्हारा टू इंटू ब्रैकेट टू अपॉन एप्सलॉन माइनस वन इफ देर आर एन नंबर ऑफ शील्ड्स देन व्हाट इज दैट इक्वेशन जस्ट मल्टीप्लाय डिनामिनेटर बाय टू एन इक्वेशन डिनोमिनेटर टू अपॉन एप्सलॉन माइनस वन प्लस टू अपॉन एप्सलॉन माइनस वन एक टर्म है टू टाइम्स टू अपॉन एप्सलॉन माइनस वन होते एक शील्डना डिनोमिनेटर जी का टर्म है ती टू टाइम्स बरबर एन नंबर ऑफ शील्ड अल तो क्या हो रहा है एक टू इंटू मल्टीप्लिकेशन मे तो फैक्टर होते एन अल तो क्या होना एन प्लस वन इंटू दैट ब्रैकेट दैट इज टू अपॉन एप्स वन माइनस वन समझ लगा एक प्लेट आता दोन वे टर्म है जर एन प्लेट आती तो टर्म का एन प्लस वन वे सो वॉट इज दैट इक्वेशन सो राइट डाउन इज इक्वल टू ए सिग्मा पी वन रेस टू फोर ए सिग्मा टी वन रेस टू फोर माइनस टी टू रेस टू फोर ए सिग्मा टी वन रेस टू फोर माइनस टी टू रेस टू फोर डिवाइडेड बाय इन ब्रैकेट टू अपॉन एप्सलॉन माइनस वन इन टू ब्रैकेट एन प्लस वन समझ लगे बुम्हारा पहले टर्म वो समझ लगे एन एक शील्डना दोन इक्वेशन आज इक्वेशन अपन कस लिखते टू टाइम्स इन टू दैट ब्रैकेट टू अपॉन एप्सलॉन माइनस वन जर एन शील्ड आती तो क्या एन प्लस वन इन टू ब्रैकेट टू अपॉन एप्सलॉन माइनस वन ओके सो राइट ऑन दैट इक्वेशन इफ एन नंबर ऑफ शील्ड्स आर देर देन a sigma t1 raised to 4 minus t2 raised to 4 divided by 2 upon epsilon minus 1 into bracket n plus 1 okay all of you write down into bracket n plus 1 and next line we have to write down the n is nothing but number of shield capital n is nothing but number of shield okay number of shield javela n astil tya vela te equation hai okay So we have to write down this separately. That equation, if there are n number of shield, then what is the equation? A sigma t1 raised to 4 minus t2 raised to 4 divided by 2 upon epsilon minus 1 into bracket n plus 
okay so by simplification of this equation what is our equation a sigma t1 raised to 4 minus t2 raised to 4 divided by 2 upon epsilon minus 1 plus 2 upon epsilon minus 1 so by simplification we get the equation as a 2 upon epsilon plus 2 upon epsilon minus 2 all of you write down by simplification of this equation we get the equation as a a a sigma into bracket t1 raised to 4 minus t2 raised to 4 t1 raised to 4 minus t2 raised to 4 divided by 2 upon epsilon plus 2 upon epsilon minus 2 okay we are doing the simplification of that bracket 2 upon sigma minus 1 plus 2 upon sigma sorry 2 upon epsilon minus 1 plus 2 upon epsilon minus 1 so by simplification we get the equation as a 2 upon epsilon plus 2 upon epsilon minus 2 okay so we get the equation as a q122 with shield this is the equation for the q122 with shield is equal to we get the equation as a a sigma t1 raised to 4 minus t2 raised to 4 so from the denominator we have to take the 2 as a common denominator more than 2 common yeah so by taking the 2 as a common so what is the remaining term in the bracket that is 1 upon epsilon plus 1 upon epsilon minus 1 okay so this is the equation when emissivity of the each plate is same apan kay kelele hai aplya kade don plate hai tya don plate madhe radiation heat exchange honar hai ani tya don plate cha madhe apan radiation shield chi ek plate put kelele hai tya vele cha equation aplyala kay milelele hai q122 with shield and what is that equation a sigma into bracket t1 raised to 4 minus t2 raised to 4 divided by 2 into bracket 1 upon epsilon plus 1 upon epsilon minus 1 okay that's a great place you miss with as not same as not attack is made up an equation leaner okay so this is the equation for the heat transfer rate when there is a shield in between the two plates okay now we know that what is the equation for the q122 without shield already we have derived this equation so we have to write down that equation q122 without shield write down that equation q12 without shield is equal to q12 without shield is equal to so already we have derived this equation so write down that same equation jala fakta don plate hai tyacha madhe radiation heat exchange honar hai tyacha madhe radiation shield nasnar hai tya vela equation kay hai tar apan already derive kelela hai so what is that equation a sigma into bracket t1 raised to 4 minus t2 raised to 4 t1 raised to 4 minus t2 raised to 4 divided by divided by 1 upon epsilon plus 1 upon epsilon minus 1 okay 1 upon epsilon plus 1 upon epsilon minus 1 okay so this is the equation when there is a no radiation shield in between the two plates so we have two equations javela radiation shield asna ra tyavet equation and Javala radiation shield and Nasnara Tavis equation. So from these two equations, by seeing equations of these two, we get the one relation. And what is that relation? Q122 with shield. Q122 with shield is equal to half of the Q122 without shield. Okay. And this shield Javala upon use Karnara Tavala. Tini plate is available emissivity same as Narai. Tavala Plala heat transfer rate mother relation Kaimete. Javala to me shield put Karta Tavasa rate of heat transfer ha without shield cha fifty per cent as Narai. Okay. Heat transfer rate with shield is the half of the Q without shield. Okay. So we get the equation. So from these two equations, we have to get one equation or we have to get relation between the heat transfer rate with shield or heat transfer rate without shield so we get the relation between these two and what is that relation q122 with shield which is shield which i will up and put for the one place i'm a day they will heat transfer rate counter at 50 percent the community you are new mahona are the owner okay so we write down that equation q122 with shield is equal to half of the Q122 without shield. Hey, kashavaran only lele hai. The G ka apni doni equation me aale. So from that two equations, we get this as a relation. Okay, Q122 with shield is equal to half of the Q122 without shield. Without shield.
without shield समझ लेगा सर ना कि कदी रिलेशन आपन यूज करना रहे when there is a emissivity of the each plate is same मतलब जब वाला तीनी प्लेट है तो तीनी प्लेट की emissivity सेम आसिल तो त्याग किस में तो आपने ही रिलेशन मिलना रहे ओके okay? heat transfer with shield is equal to half of the heat transfer without shield ओके okay? when there is a emissivity of the each plate is the same ओके okay? so this is the derivation for the heat transfer rate with shield and there is a relation between heat transfer rate with shield and heat transfer rate without shield when there is a emissivity of the each plate is the same emissivity of the each plate is the same okay so this is the equation for the q122 with shield okay so now there is a another way to find out the q with shield okay so how to find out that q with shield so already we have derived the equations for the space resistance then we have derived derived the equation for the surface resistance so in that way we have to derive the equation for the q122 with shield je ka aplyala equation milalela hai the same equation aplyala dusra method ne milte ka te aplyala check karaycha hai so all of you write down another way another way कुछ ही वे न तुम्हें इक्वेशन डिराइव करू शता है एक अपन एक मेथड ने कम्प्लीट के इक्वेशन नाउ यू हेव टू कन्सिडर दी अनादर मेथड ज्यादा कुछ ही सोपी वाटते डेरिवेशन डिराइव करू शता ओके सो ऑल ऑफ यू राइट ऑन दी से मेथड अनादर वे टू फाइंड आउट दी इक्वेशन ऑफ अनादर वे अनादर वे टू फाइंड आउट अनादर वे टू फाइंड आउट दी इक्वेशन ऑफ the equation of q with shield ata je apan equation derive kelela q with shield te apan dusra method ne solve karun baghnar hai okay so write down the heading as a another way to find out the equation of another way to find out the equation of q with shield equation of q with shield equation of q with shield okay another way to find out the equation of q with shield so all of you draw this diagram okay so there are two plates and in between the these two plates we have to putting one radiation shield so all of you draw this diagram plate number 1 plate number 2 so plate number 1 inside surface having temperature t1 emissivity is epsilon 1 and area is capital a okay then there is a shield we given the name as a plate number 3 okay so shield having left hand surface temperature is t3 emissivity so we have given the notation for the epsilon 3 1 epsilon 3 1 is nothing but emissivity of the left hand side of the shield and what is the emissivity of the right hand side of the shield that is epsilon 3 surface 2 in that manner we have given the notations for the emissivity plate number 1 ji emissivity epsilon 1 hai shield ji ji ka left hand surface asnar hai te ji emissivity ka asnar hai epsilon 3 of plate surface 1 then right hand surface having emissivity is epsilon 3 surface 2 okay then plate number 2 temperature is t2 emissivity is epsilon 2 and area is a okay so all of you draw this diagram all of you draw ओके समझ लेगा बोन प्लेट आना है दोन प्लेट ऐसी एक शील्ड आना है 
प्लेटला दोन सरपेस असणार आहेत लक्षात ठेवा पण बाहेरचा जो सरपेस आहे तिथं आपण इन्सुलेशन लावलेलं असं कन्सिडर करणार आहे प्लेट नंबर टू चा जो काय राईट हँड सरपेस आहे तिथं पण इन्सुलेशन आहे असं पण कन्सिडर करणार आहे सो व्हॉट एव्हर दी इनसाइड सर्फेस ऑफ दी प्लेट वन हॅव्हिंग टेम्परेचर इज टी वन इमिसिव्हिटी इज एप्सलॉन वन अँड एरिया इज ए ओके सिमिलरली फॉर प्लेट टू इनसाइड सर्फेस हॅव्हिंग टेम्परेचर इज टी टू इमिसिव्हिटी इज एप्सलॉन टू अँड एरिया इज ए ओके सो व्हॉट एव्हर दी रेडिएशन शिल्ड वी हॅव कन्सिडर इन बिटवीन दीज टू प्लेट दॅट इज प्लेट नंबर थ्री लेफ्ट हँड सर्फेस हॅव्हिंग टेम्परेचर इज टी थ्री अँड इमिसिव्हिटी इज एप्सलॉन थ्री ऑफ सर्फेस वन सो गिव्हन दी नोटेशन इज एप्सलॉन थ्री वन and similarly emissivity of the right hand face that is e epsilon 3 of surface 2 okay so in that way we have to given the notations okay so for this whole or overall system we have to draw one electrical system diagram samajh le ya total system sathi aplyala kay karaycha hai electrical system chi diagram put karaycha hai in the form of resistances okay so for this plate anyone can anyone tell me हाउ मेनी रेजिस्टन्सेस आर देअर हे जे आपण ओव्हरऑल सिस्टीम कन्सिडर केलेले आहे सो हाऊ मेनी रेजिस्टन्सेस आर देअर फॉर दिस ओव्हरऑल सिस्टीम ओके आउटसाइड सर्फेसला आपण इन्सुलेशन लावलेलं आहे लिव दॅट पार्ट अँड व्हॉट इज दी व्हॉट इज दी रिमे व्हॉट आर दी टोटल रेजिस्टन्सेस फॉर दिस ओव्हरऑल सिस्टीम कॅन एनी वन टेल मी किती रेजिस्टन्सेस असतील सांगा ह्या डायग्रामसाठी How many resistances are there? Anyone? Six. Then I have put it the answer six. Okay. Anyone having another answer? How many resistances are there? There are two types of resistances. Surface resistance and space resistance. Okay. Plate one. Plate one is आउटसाइड ला इन्सुलेशन असणार आहे म्हणजे तिथलं काय रेजिस्टन्स आपण कन्सिडर करणार नाही कारण प्लेट प्लेट वनच्या इनसाइड सर्फेस पासूनच ही ट्रान्सफर स्टार्ट होणार आहे सो प्लेट वनचा जो काही इनसाइड सर्फेस असणार आहे हॅव्हिंग सर्फेस रेजिस्टन्स देन प्लेट नंबर वन अँड थ्री इन बिटवीन देअर इज ए स्पेस सो देअर इज ए स्पेस रेजिस्टन्स देन प्लेट नंबर थ्री लेफ्ट हँड सर्फेस हॅव्हिंग सर्फेस रेजिस्टन्स प्लेट नंबर थ्री राईट हँड सर्फेस हॅव्हिंग सर्फेस रेजिस्टन्स then plate number 3 to 2 there is a space so therefore space resistance is there and plate number 2 inside surface surface resistance is there so therefore total six resistances are there in that four surface resistances and two space resistances are there so already we have derived the equations for the space resistance and surface resistance already apan kay kelela hai the space resistance and surface resistivity equation derive kelela hai so what is the equation for the surface resistance okay so we get the equation for the q is equal to eb minus j divided by 1 minus epsilon divided by epsilon into a okay so what is the because of what heat transfer is takes place emissive power of a black body minus radiosity so eb minus j so for the plate number 1 what is the boundary conditions or what is the difference that is eb1 and j1 so in that what is the surface resistance that is 1 upon epsilon divided by epsilon upon a 1 minus epsilon so for the plate 1 emissivity is epsilon 1 so therefore equation as a 1 minus epsilon 1 divided by a into epsilon 1 samajh le ka baga आपण सर्फेस रेजिस्टन्स ज्या इक्वेशन वरून फाइंड केलेलं आहे तिथं आपल्याला क्यू चा एक इक्वेशन मिळालेला आहे क्यू इज इक्वल टू ई बी मायनस जे डिवायडेड बाय वन मायनस एप्सलॉन डिवायडेड बाय एप्सलॉन इन टू ए हा वन मायनस एप्सलॉन डिवायडेड बाय एप्सलॉन इन टू ए म्हणजे हा सर्फेस रेजिस्टन्स इक्वेशन आहे सो फॉर दी प्लेट नंबर वन प्लेट नंबरच्या वन च्या खाली तीच तो रेजिस्टन्स दाखवायचा लक्षात ठेवा जे काही मी रेजिस्टन्सचे डायग्राम काढलेले आहे खाली जर तो प्रत्येक रेजिस्टन्स हा त्या डायग्रामच्या खालती आला म्हणजे प्लेट नंबर वन च्या खालती प्लेट नंबर वन ऐसी खाती कुछ रेजिस्टन्स है देर इज ए सर्फेस रेजिस्टन्स सर्फेस रेजिस्टन्स सो वॉट इज द इक्वेशन फॉर द सर्फेस रेजिस्टन्स वन अपॉन एप्सलॉन वन डिवाइडेड बाय ए इन टू एप्सलॉन वन एंड वॉट इज दिकॉज ऑफ वॉट डिफरेंस हिट ट्रांसफर टेक्स प्लेस ई बी एंड जे सो ई बी वन इन टू जे वन दिस इज द बाउंड्री कंडीशन फॉर द प्लेट नंबर वन प्लेट नंबर वन आ थ्री ऐसी मध्य है स्पेस रेजिस्टन्स and we know that what is the equation for the space resistance that is q1 to 2 is equal to j1 minus j2 divided by 1 upon a1 f12 so by using that what is the boundary conditions for that space resistance j1 and j2 
so in this case plate number 3 surface 1 so therefore j1 and j3 1 j3 1 and what is the space resistance 1 upon a1 f13 okay so in that same manner we have to write down the equation for the each resistance pehla plate sa is surface resistance then whatever the space between plate number 1 and 3 we have to write down the space resistance then plate number 3 inside surface we have to write down the surface resistance plate number 3 right hand surface we have to write down the surface resistance then in between plate number 3 and 2 we have to denote the space resistance and at the plate number 2 we have to denote the surface resistances okay so all of you write down draw that diagram in the form of resistances we have to write down the boundary temperatures or boundary values and then we have to denote the what is the values of each resistance for this total six resistances are there je kai sa resistance hai tya sa resistance cha value leche hai according to the notations we have given in the diagram je kai notations apan diagram madhe dilele tya notations praman apan kay karnar hai sagle resistance lihnar hai okay ani jo kai resistance hai jacha resistance hai तो रेजिस्टन्स त्या प्लेट 1 चा रेजिस्टन्स प्लेट प्लेट च्या बरोबर खाली आला पाहिजे स्पेस रेजिस्टन्स म्हणजे तो प्लेट नंबर 1 आणि 3 च्या बरोबर मध्ये आला पाहिजे प्लेट 3 च्या लेफ्ट हँड साइड चा रेजिस्टन्स हा ते थोडासा लेफ्ट हँड साइडला दिसला पाहिजे राईट हँड साइड चा थोडा राईट हँड साइडला दिसला पाहिजे स्पेस रेजिस्टन्स प्लेट 3 आणि 2 मधला हा बरोबर सेंटरला दिसला पाहिजे प्लेट नंबर 3 आणि 2 च्या आणि सरफेस रेजिस्टन्स ऑफ प्लेट 2 ऍट द प्लेट नंबर 2 सो इन दैट वे वी हैव टू ड्रॉ दिस इलेक्ट्रिक एनालॉजी डायग्राम एंड वी हैव टू write down the all the values of the resistances okay all of you complete this task draw, draw that resistance diagram समजले का बघा सगळ्यांना जे काही रेजिस्टन्स येणार आहे त्या प्रत्येक रेजिस्टन्स आपल्याला इक्वेशन लिहायचं आहे आणि आपण ज्या वेळेला इक्वेशन डिराईव्ह केलं सरफेस रेजिस्टन्स असताना आपण काय घेतोय इमेसी पॉवर ऑफ ब्लॅक बॉडी मायनस रेडिओसिटी आणि ज्या वेळेला स्पेस रेजिस्टन्स असणार आहे त्यावेळेला आपण काय घेणार आहे जे वन मायनस जे टू म्हणजे रेडिओसिटी मायनस रेडिओसिटी सो इन दॅट वे वी हॅव टू गिव्ह दी नोटेशन्स इन दॅट रेजिस्टन्स डायग्राम अँड राईट डाऊन दी वैल्यू ऑफ रेजिस्टन्स फॉर दी ईच प्लेट और स्पेस रेजिस्टन्स ओके ऑल ऑफ यू कम्प्लीटेड दिस रेजिस्टन्स डायग्राम मैं आरो कर रेजिस्टन्स की वैल्यू खाली लिखे है सगैया प्रत्येक मैं लिखे है रेजिस्टन्स की वैल्यू जी का आरो कर खाली लिखे है सो ऑल ऑफ यू राइट ऑन दी वैल्यूज ऑफ द रेजिस्टन्स फॉर दी ईच रेजिस्टन्स ओके ऑल ऑफ यू कम्प्लीटेड दिस anyone reply in the chat box so that i will proceed all of you completed samjhun gya sagalyani surface resistance cha vela difference jo asnar hai to emsu power of a black body ani radio city jo asnar hai what is the equation for the surface resistance 1 upon epsilon divided by a into epsilon so in that way we have to write down the equation according to the notations je ka apan notation ghetle tya form madhe apan equation lihnar ani apla space resistance ka asto 1 upon a1 into f12 this is the standard equation so in this case area is the same so in that manner we have taken as 1 upon a then f1 to 2 is there if plate number 1 and 2 is there at that time e of 1 to 2 have taken but in this case plate 1 to 3 is there so we have taken as a e of 1 3 okay so in that way according to notation we have to change the notations in that particular equation okay so resistance diagram is over can anyone reply me reply in the chat box okay yes sir i have completed what about others have you completed the resistance diagram all of you written the resistance values for the each resistance sagrani vyavasthit lihun gya ata apan already equation derive kelele dusra method ne hi dusri method hai tar tumhala kutli sopi vatte baga okay so now 
next slide now we have to write down the equation for the q122 with shield okay already by using the another method we have derived this equation now we have to write down the equation for the q122 with shield so in this case we have to write down the equation so at the numerator we have to take the difference of the emissive power that is eb1 minus eb2 divided by summation of all resistances so in this case total six resistances are there total six resistances are there so all of you write down the sum of all the resistances okay q122 with shield is equal to eb1 minus eb2 divided by summation of resistances okay summation of resistance madhe kutle kutle resistance asnar ahet surface one sa resistance okay r surface of one plate number one plus r space in between the plate one and three madla jo kai asnar ahet space resistance plus r surface of the plate number three surface one plus r surface of the plate number three surface two plus r space resistance between plate number three and two plus r surface resistance of plate number two so in that way we have to write down the equation so this is the standard equation at the denominator we have to take the summation of all resistances mhanje sagayachi sum gyaycha je kay resistance ahet mhanu apan pratyek resistance lelela hai okay first resistance asnar to plate 1 cha surface resistance asnar hai tyachanantar space resistance tyachanantar plate 3 cha surface 1 cha surface resistance plate 3 cha surface 2 cha surface resistance tyachanantar plate 3 ani 2 madla space resistance ani plate 2 cha surface resistance so all of you write down this equation q12 with shield is equal to q12 with shield is equal to eb1 minus eb2 eb1 minus eb2 divided by write down that term r surface 1 plus r space plus r surface 3 1 plus r surface 3 2 plus r space plus r surface 2 okay so already we have written the equation for this each resistance then we have to put the each value of the resistance into this equation okay so eb1 so already we know that eb1 is nothing but sigma t1 raised to 4 this is the stephen boltzmann law emissive power of a black body is directly proportional to the fourth power of absolute temperature so from that we get the equation as eb is equal to sigma t1 raised to 4 and eb2 is nothing but sigma t2 raised to 4 okay so in that manner we have to write down the equation sigma into bracket t1 raised to 4 minus t2 raised to 4 okay and then we have to write down the value of each resistance at the denominator so surface resistance of plate 1 what is that equation 1 minus epsilon 1 divided by a into epsilon 1 plus what is the space resistance 1 upon a1 f13 plus what is the surface resistance of plate 3 surface 1 that is 1 minus epsilon 3 1 divided by a into epsilon 3 1 plus what is the surface resistance of the plate number 3 surface 2 that is 1 minus epsilon 3 2 divided by a into epsilon 3 2 plus what is the space resistance in between plate number 3 and 2 that is 1 upon a into f 3 2 plus what is the surface resistance of the plate number 2 that is 1 minus epsilon 2 divided by a into epsilon 2 so already we have written the equation in the resistance diagram then we have to put that value into equation and we have to write down the equation for the q12 with shield q12 with shield okay so all of you write down that equation Okay, 
so all of you put the values into this equation so already we have seen the silent features of the shape factor okay so from that silent features we have written the equations for the two parallel plates and what is that value of shape factor that is f322 and f123 that value becomes 1 okay jevela don parallel plates asnar ahet infinitely long asthil tevela shape factor kay asto f322 and f123 okay that value becomes 1 so now we have to put that shape factor that is f32 is equal to f13 is equal to 1 so in this equation instead of f13 and f32 we have to put the value as a 1 re ha equation madhe f13 and f32 chi value 1 put kara so now equation becomes a sigma t1 raised to 4 minus t2 raised to 4 divided by 1 minus epsilon so from the denominator we have to considering the same area is there so from the denominator we have, we have to take the area at the numerator area at the numerator so therefore we have taking the area at the numerator so a sigma t1 raised to 4 minus t2 raised to 4 divided by एरिया अपन का डिनामिनेटर डिनामिनेटर ला कुछ घेना है न्यूमरेटर लेना है सो देर फोर ए सिग्मा टी वन रेस टू फोर माइनस टी टू रेस टू फोर दिस इज दैल्यू फॉर द न्यूमरेटर एंड एट द डिनामिनेटर वट एवर द रिमेनिंग वैल्यूज वी हेव टू पुट वन माइनस एप्सलॉन वन डिवाइडेड बाय एप्सलॉन वन कारण एरिया ऑलरे वन वरती है अपन प्लस एफ वन थ्री वन आना है एरिया वरती है फिर वन रहना है वन प्लस वन माइनस एप्सलॉन थ्री वन Divided by epsilon three one plus one minus epsilon three two divided by epsilon three two plus one plus one minus epsilon two divided by epsilon two. Okay. समझ लेगा shape factor अपन ये अब three two और ये अब one three one consider के लिए लाए अन्य area वाव taken at the numerator so therefore we get the equation. Okay, so by simplification of this equation, now we have to do the simplification of this equation. There we get the equation as a. The equation is just me simplification. Okay, let us. Tomorrow equation can be written. Numerator will be same. That is a sigma t1 raised to 4 minus t2 raised to 4. The first term we have to take the first term one minus epsilon one divided by epsilon one. So what is the simplification of this term? That is one upon epsilon one minus one. ये चमुलो क्या होना है minus one plus one cancel होना है. So what is the remaining terms? We have to write down the remaining terms into the equation. So q one two two with shield. Okay. Similarly. One minus epsilon three one divided by epsilon three one. At that, in that equation by simplification, we get as a one upon epsilon three one minus one. Okay, so plus one minus one will be cancelled. So by doing this way, the simplification we get the equation for the q one two two with shield. Q one two two with shield, and what is that equation? Is equal to a sigma t one raised to four minus t two raised to four divided by Into first bracket one upon epsilon one plus one upon epsilon two minus one plus into another bracket one upon epsilon three one plus one upon epsilon three two minus one. Is it to me simplification killer? The simplification killer. And then to my two equation me till and we are putting that equations into the two separate brackets. That is one upon epsilon one plus one upon epsilon two minus one plus Into another bracket, one upon epsilon three one plus one upon epsilon three two minus one. Okay, समझे कब आगे समझना? Write down these equations.
So all of you write down this equation. Simplification mode, you have equation mode. Hai. Okay, next slide. So, if you have to considering the emissivity of the all surfaces are equal, then what is the equation? Q is equal to A sigma T1 raised to 4 minus T2 raised to 4. And if sigma value is the same, then we get the equation as a 2 into bracket 2 upon sigma minus 2 upon epsilon minus 1. Equation with Magachika method with the type method with the Panapala equation. Q is equal to A sigma T1 raised to 4 minus T2 raised to 4 divided by 2, 2 into bracket 2 upon epsilon minus 1. Javala A radiation shield put Karnara, Tavala denominator like I mean 2 into bracket 2 upon epsilon minus 1. And if there are n number of shields, so all of you write down if there are n number of shield, if there are n number of shield then we have to write down the equation for the q q is equal to a sigma t1 raised to 4 minus t2 raised to 4 there will be x shield as the denominator upon 2 get 2 into bracket 2 upon epsilon minus 1 and if there are n number of shield suppose we have to considering if n number of shields the table's equation kind of we have to take the q n is equal to a sigma T1 raised to 4 minus T2 raised to 4 divided by n plus 1 into bracket 2 upon epsilon minus 1. So, at the denominator, we have to take the 2 into bracket 2 upon epsilon minus 1. And if there are n number of shield, so we have to add that term by the 1. A is not n plus 1. So, therefore, at the denominator, n plus 1 into bracket 2 upon epsilon minus 1 n plus 1 into bracket 2 upon epsilon minus 1 2 upon epsilon minus 1 okay so this is the equation when there is a radiation shield upon the only method to solve kill to mal kutli method easy what the baga the chapman to me solve koro shakta okay we can Use any method to derive this derivation or to solve the different problems. After we will problem solve karajet, the problem with me could he could leave equation use karushakta by using that we have to find out the heat transfer rate with shield, heat transfer rate without shield, okay, and their relation, okay. So here we have to stop. All of you put your roll numbers in the chat box. Yes, sir. After two, three minutes, we have to stop the recording. I will convey a message to you.
ओके या सर स्टॉप द रिकॉर्डिंग एंड लीव द मीटिंग